In this video, you are going to learn how to get maximum results with your diet and exercise. Hey everyone, I am Payas Bharadwaj, 30 year old father, an online fitness coach and nutrition specialist. Trying to lose weight is one of those age old dilemmas which many of us continue to face. Especially now in the information age, there are so many solutions for losing weight that you are likely to end up more confused than successful on your weight loss mission. Regardless of which strategy you use to lose weight, though there is one item that's often overlooked. The cause of your previous weight loss defeats might be that you haven't been able to achieve a successful balance of diet and exercise. Achieving that balance is the quickest, most effective way to get results you are looking for. This is the main reason why people inside the 12 weeks lean body program reach their fitness goals faster. Try these strategies for getting diet and exercise to work together for your best outcome. Number one, eat sufficiently on workout days. Even though you are working towards burning off calories, exercise actually works better when you maintain healthy consumption patterns. The body needs fuel to do what you want it to do. That fuel comes from food, so restricting it may result in ineffective workouts. Not consuming enough on workout days can cause your body to go into survival mode and burn valuable muscle tissues instead of fat because it feels you are starving it. Match food choices with types of exercise. Depending on the types of exercise you are doing, the food choices you make can help or hinder your results. For example, carbohydrates are best for workouts that require high energy like high intensity interval training, weight training and other cardiovascular workouts. Protein is effective at building muscle and burning fat. So on days when you are doing weight training, you should ensure you consume enough of this food group. Fibrous foods also give energy but have a more lasting effect. They also help to flush the digestive system which aids significantly in weight loss. Try adding more healthy grains and fruits into your diet. Save cheat snacking for your rest days. The worst thing you can do is make unhealthy food choices on workout days. Give yourself a cheat day each week when you can indulge in one or two of your favorite guilty pleasure eats. Avoid overdoing it. Set workout time around your meal schedule. It's important to set your workout time around your meal schedule so you are able to get as much worth as possible from your meals. Otherwise, the foods you eat may just leave your system without being of much benefit to you in your workout. Experts recommend that on average, anywhere between 1 and 2 hours after a meal is a good time frame to wait before working out. By then, your body is likely ready to make use of fuel you gave it. It's also a good idea to switch up your meal content depending on the time you would like to exercise. For example, you could have high carbohydrate meals earlier in the day and exercise earlier so you can burn much of it for energy. Use these steps to get the maximum benefit from the diet and exercise so you can achieve the fit and trim body you have always wanted. If you have struggled to lose weight even though you are exercising, balancing your diet and exercise routines, register for a free video training on my website gympanzi.com. We are going to discover the three reasons why most people fail to achieve a lean and toned body and how to fix it. For that, click the link in the description to get started. I'll see you there.